One of the perks of buying the upcoming Alcatel Idol 4S is the fact that it's VR ready right out of the box. That's something that you don't get with most phones. And it's something that most buyers of the phone will appreciate. But is it any better than the other alternatives? Now this will draw comparisons to Samsung's Gear VR headset since they appear very similar. We will say however that Alcatel's headset offers a more substantial amount of padding with a strap that fits behind the head. It's been meticulously thought out which are evident in the gaps around the front shielding panel. They provide continued and uninterrupted access to the headphone jack and micro USB port. Meanwhile, on the underside, you have the touch sensitive buttons for the back and select functions. So yeah, you could probably argue that the design's a predictable one, but there's one distinguishable feature about the design. And it's the fact that it also doubles as a useful travel case because not only does it accommodate the phone itself, but you can throw in the headphones, the micro USB cable, and also the charger inside the cavity. So it makes it a lot easier to travel around with. Setting it up is a snap. You just place the phone into position and Alcatel's VR interface automatically launches. Since there isn't a touch sensitive D-pad like what's on the Samsung Gear VR, navigation is done by moving your head and pointing the dot at what you want to select. In terms of the VR experience, there isn't a whole lot different here from what we experience elsewhere. It's still the same static VR experience because it mainly centers around being in a fixed position, whether that's sitting down or standing up. You can view things like photos and videos as well as 360 degree content. There's also the little star portal where you can download additional VR content. The vast majority of what's available are just simply 360 degree videos and that's it. We hope that more content will come around once the phone officially launches in the US on August 3rd. Thankfully, you could download the Google Cardboard app to the phone and use the VR headset for that. So you can download more content besides just 360 videos because let's be honest, it gets boring after a while. So we hope that Alcatel can actually diversify its portfolio with Lil Star. The Alcatel Idol 4S's Snapdragon 652 chip and three gigabytes of RAM have enough punch for a manageable mobile VR experience. Some of the games we installed and played exhibit a fair amount of responsiveness in the VR world, so at least it matches what we experience with other solutions. At the end of the day, we can say two things about Alcatel's VR headset. First, it's ingeniously designed since it accommodates the phone and its accessories. Secondly, there's no additional cost. It's already included with the purchase of the phone. And besides that, this is very much like the majority of other mobile VR headsets out there. It just needs more content in its stores beyond 360 degree videos because right now it's slim pickings with the content. So if you guys want to learn more about the Alcatel VR headset, you could check out our website, VR Source, your source for all kinds of reality.